All right, this is Michael John with Motorhomes Go in beautiful Grand Rapids, Michigan. Here to show you the Georgetown 30X today. It's a GT3, beautiful coach. Let's uh, take a walk around. Sorry about the wind here. Um, first of all, very beautiful uh, one-piece automotive bonded windshield out front. You have uh, some heated mirrors that are also uh, remote on both sides, and then some colored cameras on the side so when you turn your blinker on you can see down the entire side of the coach eliminating some blind spots beautiful long awning with a LED strip underneath so I couldn't get that out we're a little too close to this other coach um, and then uh, three three step into your coach which isn't a big deal for some people but if you have elderly or some injured person it makes it a lot easier to get into the coach and then I will pull out too this is a 30 inch Door, which is a lot wider than some doors so uh, just again makes it easy to get in and out of the coach or if you're bringing something in or out of the coach uh, makes it super easy um, outside you have uh, some rain speakers a little entertainment center so you can hang out at the raceway or football or do some um, camping outside and just enjoy watching that here you have a rotocast compartment and uh, what's good about that is it's not going to rust out on you. You can get it dirty and just uh, spray it down. And it'll just go down the little uh, hole there in the back and clean it up, keep it clean. You can even throw ice in here if you wanted to. Throw your cold sodas in there for the game. If you're doing that, doing any outside um, storage. Uh, six gallon hot water uh, heater in this unit. And uh, that's just the storage compartment for the batteries. Here's another uh, rotocast storage compartment here more storage here's a nice big pass-through storage now that is a lot of space up in there and we'll get another look on the other side uh, you can get a ladder with this unit which isn't the same on all units I'll point out this one right here with no ladder and what's good about that is you can get on the roof you know once a season just clean it off so if it rains you're not gonna have all that dirt running down the side of your coach and also, uh, you can check your seals while you're up there. Just make sure around the air conditioner um, and whatnot that uh, those seals are good. It is a one-piece fiberglass roof, which is very important. Um, it's, it's a great, long-lasting roof. And with that one piece, it's, it's going to last a long, long time. You also have a rear-view color camera up top. And a 5,000-pound hitch down below. So, here's the other side of that pass-through storage. Plenty of space. They even give you a nice inverter in this unit. So what that means is you can use your coach batteries to plug in your laptop, your cell phones, whatnot inside. Even when you're not plugged in um, uh, with, this, with this in your campground. Uh, so we'll keep going. We have another couple of uh, Rotocast uh, storage compartments up front and a 4,000 watt generator by Onan. Uh, and then here's your wet bay just real quick and we'll get on the inside outdoor shower you can spray all this stuff down back black uh, tank flush is right in there as well even give you a little lights inside here so you can do it at night which is great all right now let's get to the exciting part which is the inside and I mentioned the wider door here but uh, they even give you kind of two handles one when you first start walking into the coach or you can just grab onto this long uh, stainless steel bar. Again, just safety first in these units. Real nice, easy step up. Down, down below here is where you can um, turn your uh, steps on and off uh, so that it'll be automatic or you can leave them out once you get camping. Also, um, turn on your coach right from here. That way um, you can power up without having to get into the coach. Sorry, I had a moment there but uh, some nice LED lighting in here beautiful counter space well, let's turn around into the coach first I have these chairs turned around so you can see that you have a lot of living room space here um, just a really nice layout up front you have uh, let's start with the automatic leveler and that is hydraulic um, it's automatic you just push the button and uh, there you go up uh, here you got some switches for your meat, your mirror, your heated mirror, and then the battery boost there just means uh, if you leave your lights on 
in your engine on your uh, engine battery or your you know, your front of your coach and you drain your battery you can still start your coach um, by your coach batteries so they're separate batteries uh, power shades on the front there just by a push of a button and here you have um, USB um, DVD player that uh, you can play without throughout the coach all right and uh, this is a nice feature here too just a push button down this will lower down you have a bunk up top we won't put it all the way down but just see that's a pretty good size space I mean you can get a um, a nice size adult up there you can have a little few uh, compartments for for them as well but we'll move that up and uh, again show you the kitchen space where you do have a little extra space here if you lift that up but wow there's plenty of space on this countertop already uh, what they really did a good job with this coach was plenty of counter space plenty of drawers for all your stuff um, even hidden space behind the TV here there's where you put all the cookies keep the kids out of those all right you get a double sink that's stainless nice covers as well if you're not using it and uh, good size refrigerator here that does run on LP or electric and it has an automatic switch so once you plug it at the park it'll automatically switch over to electric three burner stove and I like this glass top they put up here just to give you some more countertop space if you're not using or cooking uh, on your stove there you got an oven with this unit as well and we'll turn around to the dinette space this is a dream dinette so it's just a lever you push down this will drop down you can make that into a bed this is actually a sleeper sofa so if, if the bed up top wasn't enough and the dinette wasn't enough here you have another uh, bed as well and you can hang out on this kick your feet up um, watch the TV that's uh, right over here it's a nice size 40 inch television so they just do a really nice job vinyl floors throughout here as well I like to point out uh, the shower is a glass door it doesn't have a chintzy plastic uh, it's a nice three three shower door big nice big uh, shower in here as well and then while we're back here there's no steps in this coach there's no step ups there's no step downs it is one um, piece all the way through so you just have a flush floor and it, that's nice for some people so you're not gonna be tripping over anything and we'll sneak into the bathroom here you have a porcelain a porcelain uh, foot flush to uh, toilet and I even like that they put a stainless sink in here instead of a plastic one so that's not going to stain over time and some more cabinet space and let's see if I can point this out here's where you're gonna put your slides in and out um, you turn your water heater on you can check your tanks gray tank black tank fresh tank your battery level and then of course your LP tank as well um, and also this unit does come with the Arctic pack which is really good for Michigan we do get some colder weather up here and uh, that's going to keep your tanks heated so you don't have those problems of frozen pipes and whatnot inside the bedroom nice walk around bed it is king size that's great um, a couple huge wardrobes here let me just see if we can get inside there I should turn the lights on, on the coach but uh, nice big uh, two, two wardrobes more storage space up over here nice nightstand and the TV more space secret space back there uh, would like to point out too you have your own air conditioner back here and also another air conditioner up top a lot of coaches this size are just skimping down with one air conditioner here you can just shut this little pocket door right here keep that air in the back or um, you know just have them both open if you like and just cool down the whole coach so uh, i think that's about it i hope uh, you enjoyed this short tour if you have any questions just feel free to give me a call again this is mike john motorhomes go thank you